Welcome everybody. Today I'm going to be doing a, my last, hopefully my last mullet cut. I'm not liking it so far. This is be my fourth one. This time I'm doing something a little different. I'll do it a little bit shorter on the sides. Um, this one here is it's about a half inch. By the time you add both these pieces, a little bit less than a half inch. And then what I did is I cut a perfectly square piece. I cut it at an angle. Um, this angle Hopefully we'll, we'll blend in for the side for the back so I'm not cutting the back. Last time I just used something a little bit longer and that didn't seem to work out too well. Um, and then when I get done, I'll go up and trim around my ears or whatever just with a little trimmer just to try to make it look better. But I'm not sure, not convinced yet that a Floby can do a mullet. So I've already put my oil, my three in one oil on the blades. And I'm going to do the sides first with a short one. And then I'll do the back. So let's get started. Doesn't take much. You really don't know until I go trim it and wash it again, even though I washed it once. So it makes it really easy to cut. I probably spent an extra minute or plus, which I didn't have to do. So try not to miss a spot or whatever, just overdoing it. So it doesn't take that much. I can't, can't really tell how it is right now. I'm just trying to keep some of the length in the back. Not sure. I'll grab one after I trim it. I'll grab a camera and just walk around my head. Just, uh, See if I miss a spot, see if it, what it looks like. So I'll be back shortly. I am back. I trimmed around the ears, wasn't much a trim. Um, I think my last cut was six weeks ago, maybe two months ago. Um, I think it turned out pretty good. Um, I'll grab the camera and walk around and you be the judge. Um, I'll hang on to it for a few days and see what the grandkids say. <laughs> 